Hi, this is RGK and I'm showing you time record. So the game is not yet available for purchase, not even early access or something. This is just an alpha and so it means this cannot be a review. It's just a let's play because I have the right to show gameplay videos, not to review it. So it's a story about like Paris has been destroyed and a group from the future, I mean the future of 1987, is uh, trying to send people to the past to try to avert the catastrophe and like for instance try to remove scientists from the person that will create the destruction or try to recruit scientists that will help the resistance to build the machines and so on. And so here this is the headquarters of the resistance and I'm being sent on a rescue mission apparently. So let's go back to the past. So I, I wanted to show this game because it kind of looks like also Hotline Miami and Mr. Shifty and I just reviewed Mr. Shifty so good timing. You have a slow motion whenever you kill someone and you have a dash activated when you kill two people. And the more you increase your combo bar, the better your powers become, like suddenly some sort of tele very strong telekinesis. Alright, can I access this area? No, I'll have to go around. There is a melee attack, but it's very weak. I'd rather avoid using it. Let's try here, and I died, you see? There is almost no point using the melee. Oh, I died again. So yeah, one bullet and you're dead. Typical hotline mummy and so on. So shifty. So it, it's all in the same kind of vein of hardcore top-down shooters. It's actually quite nice to have the slow-mo and you, you need to count your bullet most of the time, you don't need to count them like literally but you need to be careful because you can run out very quickly and since we have seen that melee is not good one needs to be really careful and that's why the dash and other powers can become really useful for melee to dash these two. I completely missed them. Yeah, so if you, if you like this sort of um, die we try, that's typically it. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking for just a moment so I can focus on my game. And here we go. Just a matter of paying attention to what I was doing. Alright, so I cleaned this whole area. I like the destruction of the environment as well. If I kill a second one, I can get the dash. Yes, I'll finish this guy off. Perfect. Destroy. Activate the elevator. Go to the next level. Mm, quick, quick. No, I wanted to kill him quickly so I could get the dash. This part of the level. Give me dash, yes, thank you. I kill this one as a bonus and I'll just dash here. Dash, oh no, the key. <laughs> Don't dash through there. Yeah, I'm gonna get their weapons because mine was starting to run out of bullets. And I run out of life. This is getting quite tricky, isn't it? Here, here, and dash. Two kills. Get the key. No. Don't get the key. It must be down there somewhere. Hello. One, two, and dash. What did it say? Like, oh, I killed the target. 
Nah, I should capture Oh well. Alright, clean this area. Hit again. Oof, that was close. Alright, not killing you this time. Follow me, Counter Strike House Stage. Second one, that's it. So now I can create a wormhole and everyone goes merrily back to the future. Actually, I'm the only character that can do a two way trip. Everyone else just dies. So they did their one way trip, so they're fine, but if they go back again in time, they would die. And now we have a full team of scientists in our headquarters. Anyway, so I guess that's uh, enough for the video. You have seen kind of how the game plays, what it's about and so on. So yeah, keep an eye on Time Recall. Hope you enjoyed this video. Bye bye. Ooh.